objectives to understand how plants reproduce got hold of you sham if you keep hiding in the same place then it will be easy for us to find you right hmm these red roses smell so nice look ramu kaka has cut a part of the stem of the rose plant and he has put it in the soil why is he doing something like that come let us ask ramu kaka hello ramu kaka we just saw that you cut a part of the stem of the rose plant and planted it in the back in the soil we could not understand as to why you did that children i cut a part of the rose plant stem and planted it in the soil in a few days roots will emerge and it will become a new plant oh so plants reproduce in such ways too i want to know more about this i shall ask grandfather he has a lot of interest in gardening this means that in plants like roses it is a method of reproduction look when i saw this pond last week the moss was only on some area but today the whole pond is green this is algae remember we read in the first chapter in science that algae grow in the presence of water and nutrients but how do we find out that how does algae spread so fast don't be worried children let me tell you I have been seeing this pond for a number of years. Friends, algae get divided into two or more parts. These divided parts or subparts become a different creature, and with this continuous growth, the algae spreads over a large area. There are a lot of secrets hidden in nature. It is astonishing to know that the algae reproduce through the means of division. Look, this is the mango plant. This is such a little plant. Sham, you must take care of this plant. Children, come inside. Come and eat something. Sham, there are some apples lying near the basket of potatoes. Please bring them. I shall cut them and give them to you. Yes, mom, sure. What is this green and white color growth on the potatoes? Let me show it to Rani and Ram. Look what is this on these potatoes it looks they have gone bad i have seen this a few times earlier when the potatoes become old we can see such growth on them my mother told me that this is known as the eye of the potato eye of the potato since when did potatoes have eye yes children rani's mother was right this is known as the eye of the potato Why don't all of you conduct an experiment? You will understand better like that. What kind of an experiment, mother? Cut this potato into two halves, take them and sow them in the soil outside. Water it every day and then see what happens in a few days. Friends, shall we do as mother said? Yes, yes, yes sure. sure. There we are. Done. Now we will have to come and water this every day. and come to your house every day children rani sham and ram looked every day at the place where they had planted the potato after a few weeks there was tiny little plant over there rani ram see didn't i say that i saw a few leaves growing look yes you are right a plant of potato emerged when we sowed a potato this is like the rose plant we saw isn't it Children, there are a few eye-like structures on me. After a few weeks, these grow into new plants. Besides potato, onion, ginger, and turmeric also reproduce asexually through vegetative propagation. I completely forgot in this conversation that mother had asked me to bring bread from the market. I shall also come with you Rani now soon we will eat mangoes and potatoes from Sham's own field look Ram this bread has fungus on it take through this you know Ram whenever we buy bread we must be watchful of fungus but how did this fungus come on the bread come 
First, let us go and give a mother a bread, and then we shall look for answer to your question. Isn't it so interesting, friends, that it is possible for some plants to reproduce without a flower or seed? Plants of rose and potato through vegetative propagation, algae through budding and fungus through fragmentation. I want to know more about reproduction in plants. Now we shall learn about this in the next video.